Soda may be a popular beverage, but it's not doing your body any favors. Here are the top 12 reasons why soda isn't good for your health. One can of soda contains more sugar than the daily recommended limit, which can lead to weight gain and an increased risk of diabetes. Artificial sweeteners in diet sodas are much sweeter than sugar and can increase your cravings for sweet foods, leading to overeating and weight gain. The high levels of sugar and acid in soda can erode the enamel on your teeth, leading to cavities and tooth decay. Soda can dehydrate you, as it contains caffeine and can act as a diuretic, making you lose more fluids than you take in. Drinking soda can increase your risk of heart disease, as it can raise your blood pressure and cholesterol levels. Soda contains no nutritional value, meaning you're consuming empty calories that don't provide your body with any beneficial nutrients. The artificial sweeteners and preservatives in diet soda have been linked to a variety of health problems, including headaches, mood disorders and digestive issues. Soda can lead to an increased risk of kidney stones, as the phosphoric acid in soda creates an acidic environment in your urine. The high levels of caffeine in soda can disrupt your sleep patterns and lead to insomnia. Drinking soda can lead to dehydration and increased fatigue, as the high levels of sugar can cause your blood sugar to spike and crash. Consuming soda on a regular basis can lead to addiction, as the high levels of sugar and caffeine can cause cravings and withdrawal symptoms. Overall, while diet soda may seem like a healthier option, it still contains artificial sweeteners which are even more worse than sugar and have negative impacts on your health. So the next time you're looking for a refreshing drink, think twice before reaching for a soda. Finally, it's best to limit your intake of diet soda and opt for healthier beverage options like water or unsweetened tea. Your body will thank you in the long run for choosing a healthier option. Isn't your health the most important asset you have after all?